Before I start today's video, I just got back from the Halo World Championship Series and it ain't cheap. I bought 1400 stickers to give away to fans at the event. If you want to help support me and support my work, I have full sets of all seven of these beautiful 4 inch by 4 inch vinyl stickers available on my store, limited to 100 sets only. Once they're gone, they are gone for good. And I'm offering a really good deal, seven stickers for only 20 bucks. Grab them while you can. Okay, a couple of announcements before we get started today because we have actually got quite a lot to get through. First of all, this has been a whirlwind of a couple of months for me. I have not stopped working or traveling or doing something major for a long time and not even the last two months. I haven't had a break from YouTube as a whole for about three years and I'm taking my first vacation with my brother, my sister-in-law and nephew. We're going to China to where I used to live. We're actually flying out in a day and a half's time and I'm going for six weeks. And because of that, I have moved practically everything that I own into a storage unit. Practically my entire Halo Mega collection is gone. It's in a metal container somewhere which is pretty crazy. I've just got a few boxes left uh, from some inventory for the website, and that's it. I'm, uh, I'm going dark, but I have been grinding away to make sure that there is at least one video per week for the entire time I'm gone, usually two, and maybe at times three. I've uploaded, I think, about 14 videos right now. They're some of my highest quality. I'm really proud of them. A lot of new, like, abstract concepts that I've been trying out, some news updates, the hunt for Halo Heroes returns. There's some really exciting stuff. Um, so all of my stuff is gone, and I'm going to China to literally just disconnect from everything, from the noise, from the tinnitus that is building up in my ears because I swear I'm just working too hard. And when I get back in the uh, sort of winter time, I'm gonna be launching some really, really excited new projects and going hard on the archiving of all of this information, going hard on expanding my website, going hard on to, you know, into the future. I got like, Right now, I am more optimistic about Halo and the future of Halo than I have been in a long, long time. So I'm gonna be talking about that today. Uh, it's just gonna be uh, non-stop, no editing. I just wanna sort of get a few points out there and um, you know, move on from there. The second point I wanted to make was that um, I just got back from the Halo World Championship Series final in Seattle, Washington. And um, these things are not cheap. Um, I go and do it off my own back. I wish I could get sponsored better, but I, it's very difficult. So um, I'm in a bit of a money hole with the fact that I went to HCS, but it was an incredible opportunity. I wasn't gonna go this year up until two weeks before. Like everybody that <laughs> knows me was really surprised I ended up going, um, but I booked it last minute. I made it because we had a community table. We actually had an official table at the Halo World Championship Series in Seattle. Just think about that. Like, that's my third time I've ever gone. The first time was an, as, an, as an attendee, second was as press, and third was as a partner for Halo. And I worked on the booth. We showcased an original 2010 Toys R Us display unit from Halo Mega, and uh, we worked alongside Women of Halo and the 4 5th Cosplay Division and Halo Collector. And it was just a marvelous time. I filmed a lot of cosplayers and I was there when Halo Studios was announced. And also shout out to the Halo Hype House, our Airbnb of like 14 or so people. Um, it was a wonderful experience, uh, but uh, I have uh, just got to my wits end. I am beyond exhausted. So um, I am going to finally take a big break from this channel. For anyone that doesn't know, I, you know, I've had this channel for 12 and a half years. Um, I wasn't going hard on it. I, I had it as a back burner. I actually rebranded to be a, a, a travel channel for a while while I was in Asia. But I moved to China in 2016, lived in China, Vietnam and Hong Kong for five years, then was in Minneapolis for a year and a half, and then um, I just got paranoid that the microphone wasn't recording. Yes, it definitely is. Um, <laughs> um, and then I uh, moved back home and I've been in my hometown for a year and a half. 
And um, I just uh, recently met a very special person, uh, somebody I've known for a couple of decades, and uh, things are going really well, and uh, the future looks really promising um, for me in general. And also for, for Halo and Mega, in some ways, it's been a very strange year, um, but... I, I do feel um, a sense of optimism in the air from Halo Studios, from the Unreal Engine 5 announcement, from CE Chief looking chunky. I'm just feeling good about it all. Um, and I also, I, I, I'm constantly trying to put things in perspective, you know. It, it's been a very difficult year um, for our community. We've seen um, the amount of products just be reduced dramatically. We've seen the closure of megaconstructs.com, of megaunbox.com, of now support.megabrands, which is a lot of the PDFs. And um, it's very challenging as a community leader um, and someone that like has my, you know, I'm dipping my toes in all the ponds of the Halo mega space. I've been in this game since the very beginning. Now I have turned 30. I turned 30 in Seattle last weekend. And um, now I'm 30. I have been collecting these products for half of my entire existence on planet Earth, which is pretty wild. Um, so, you know, it, it's um, it's a really strange position I find myself in every day, um, being a community lead and seeing things not go the direction I want them to. Um, but I've uh, I've made peace with a lot of that right now, and I, I'm kind of in the mindset now. It was really shocking to me going to the Halo World Championship Series um, this last uh, weekend because at the Halo Championship Series, I expected amongst many, many others, and I talked about this in my last uh, Talking Head video like this uh, the other day, I expected more than anything to see um, a shriveled up <laughs> post-mortem of the Halo Championship series. I thought it would be even smaller than last year, which was smaller than the year before. Um, but no, it came back stronger than ever. And it was the most tickets sold to any Halo event ever. So um, it's actually left me with a, a massive amount of optimism, which is a really surprising position to be in right now. Um, and, you know, the things are falling into place. The website's going well. Um, the archiving is making some decent um, steps forward. We have got some big releases like the Fallout set and uh, a, a potential leak that I can't talk about, but like there's some good stuff coming. Um, and I, I feel after going to the Halo Championship Series this year that my commitment to this community is is just so so strong. Um, and now that I've seen the proof that the website can make me some money, like we sold out of practically 95% of all the stock within the first, like, I don't even know how long it was, like the first 12 hours, certainly in the first like two hours, we sold out of like 80% of stock. It was absolutely nuts. And the prints have sold really well too. Um, so now that I know that that is something that I can rely on financially, I can commit so much more of my efforts to the archiving and so much more of my efforts into content creation. And um, I, 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 felt, I felt this, um, I, I had no script going into this video, to be clear. I literally just, it's like 10 p.m. And uh, I, I got home, I got back to England last night, or yesterday morning and then traveled back from London. It's been pure chaos. But um, I just, I, I'm very tired, but I thought I just sit in front of the camera and just see what comes out because I have all these feelings and uh, I just want to sort of um, speak through them. And I have already done that in the first part, which I do recommend you go and watch about uh, how Halo, I think is, uh, you know, I was almost, I'd almost given up with Halo, but um, this has been a, a massive boost for me. I got a really exciting announcement coming for the Toymation Fest um, because I know a lot of people you're excited about that. Um, I don't think that was a sentence if I play that back. Um, but uh, yeah, I got a big announcement coming with the Toymation Fest, so stay tuned for that. And uh, yeah, a lot of great videos. Um, I've just finished, you know, setting up this uh, massive light box, which is just going to be like my main studio going forward to be able to film videos. 
Um, I've been investing a lot, um, and it shows. It's it's all coming together really nicely, and now I've got my screen flipped around. I can't see if I'm in focus. Yeah, it's it's been uh, it's been coming together, um, and. This is just basically a little update um, to tell you that I'm going to be away for six weeks, that all my collections moved away, that uh, I have video schedule, but I won't be replying to things. I won't be replying to DMs uh, pretty much at all. I have, um, you know, I, I actually think I have like a pretty good balance when it comes to social media. I don't use social media outside of my work, apart from watching YouTube videos, um, but I feel like um, my brain is like 50% <laughs> internet at this point. <laughs> um, I just, I, I, I spend a lot of my time online and uh, this is a really beautiful experience I'm about to have going and reconnecting to my past um, because I, I evolved so much as a person when I was in China. So um, I'm really looking forward to just not communicating with any of you for a while. <laughs> Because I have legitimately uploaded a video like every week, sometimes mostly twice a week, a lot of the time. More than that, I mean, I did 117 days straight of uploading videos um, and I'm just tired. I, I have more drive and motivation for this YouTube channel than I have ever done in my life, but um, I just am so tired. So I'm going to take a big break. I wanted to let you all know, but the videos aren't going anywhere and I have a crazy amount of fun um, ideas for the new year concepts for archiving, creating full comprehensive guides to every one of these products. You just see like the rarity and the price online of these things going through the roof. And you know that a lot of this information is going to be lost over time if we don't do something about it, especially with the website closing. So um, I've got a wonderful team together. If you ever want to be involved in the archiving, let me know. I won't reply to any comments, but send me a DM on Instagram or Twitter and I'll reply when I get back from holidays. But um, yeah, Things are looking good. HCS was unreal. Like, if you ever have a chance, get to a Halo Championship Series. I cannot explain to you. I don't care what your opinion on esports in Halo is. Um, that will change you going to one of those events. So, uh, yeah, sh this has been Halo Boy. Um, shout out to you all. Um, just wanted to get a quick update out there. Just wanted to completely ramble. I think it came across pretty neat. <laughs> and uh, thanks so much for taking your time to watch. Um, stay awesome, stay safe, and I'll see you at the end of November. I'm going to get back stronger than ever. We're going to be doing some really fun stuff. Oh, and also shout out to the people that helped me 100% complete my Halo Heroes collection. It's done, and uh, I'm going to have some really exciting videos about it in the future. And um, also shout out to, yeah, all the people at the Halo Hype House, um, Strandy42, LS3D, uh, just everyone, I can't name them all off the top of my head, I'm tired, Silent Cartographer, Overkill MCX for being my PO box for the last couple of months, uh, yeah, tons of really just, this community is just beautiful, beautiful, beautiful thing, um, and something that I feel, um, uh, you know, at my point, uh, the part of my life um, that, that I'm really thinking about what I want for myself in the future. Community management is really what I love. Um, so being able to continue to push this community forward and continue to keep it safe, that's all that really matters for me at this present moment, that and friends and family. So stay awesome, stay safe, Domain out.